Hey, let's look at another example of synthetic division. Uh, again, we're going to take uh, the polynomial 6x to the 5th minus 2x to the 3rd plus 4x squared minus 3x plus 1 and divide it by x minus 2. So when we're doing synthetic division, for starters, you can only do it if you are dividing by a linear uh, polynomial. In this case, we are. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to set our linear polynomial equal to 0. And we'll find the 0 for that. Uh, our 0 turns out to be 2 in this problem. So that's the number that goes in the box. Again, what we're going to do is we're going to start our, uh, our, with our dividend, and we're going to write down the coefficients in descending order. So here's my x to the fifth coefficient. I don't have an x to the fourth, so I'll put zero. Uh, negative two will be my cubic coefficient, and then my quadratic is four, linear negative three, and my constant's one. So again, just a reminder of what happens first, we bring down the first number, so 6 will go below the line. Anything below the line gets multiplied by what's in the box, so 6 times 2 is 12. Any two numbers above the line get added together, so we get 12. Multiply 2 times 12 to get 24. Add those together, you get 22. Uh, multiply, we get 44. Add them together and we get 48. Oof, multiplication is going to get tough now. Uh, 80 looks like 96. Ooh, really bad. Uh, so give me a 93. And I'm going to multiply again, so that's 186. And add together, and we get 187. Just remember uh, of how to figure out what your quotient is. Um, what you're going to do is you're going to look at your dividend, the degree of your dividend, which in this case is 5, and the degree of our divisor, which is 1. And you just subtract those. So 5 minus 1 will give us 4. So we're going to start. Uh, 6 is going to be the coefficient of x to the 4th. And then plus 12x cubed. And plus 22x squared. And plus 48x. Plus 93. And just a reminder, the last number represents your remainder. So we write it over our divisor. And another example of synthetic division.